Please tell me that's Team Cardin, right? That looks like one of those Cardin punk bitches. Go ahead, do your thing, shawty. You nasty. What's up, Nasty Cast? It's your man behind the cam, aka Director Nasty, here with another Ruby Reaction Volume 3, Chapter 5, Never Miss a Beat. In the last chapter, yo, we got to see an epic and highly anticipated battle between Coco and Yat Yat Yatsuashi versus Mercury and Emerald. Yeah, his name, whoo! I'm trying, y'all, I'm trying. The fight was out of this world. What, we, what it really made me do is, I'm not gonna lie, it made me put a whole lot of respect on Mercury and Emerald, yo. More so Mercury, because he basically was like 2v1, but Emerald held her own against Coco, which I thought Coco, you know, she had that thing on her. I didn't see the, I didn't, I didn't see it ending this way, honestly. Even in, even in the show, uh, they said, oh wow, it was an upset, because everybody, including me, thought Coco and Yatsu, Yatsu Ashi was gonna win that. Yeah, that's his name. Uh, on the other side of things, we got to see a tender but rough moment with Weiss and her sister, Winner. <sighs> Winner, ha, uh, listen, I like cold. She's a little too cold for my taste, but I, can get, I might warm up to her a little bit, if you know what I mean. But uh, we got to see that she does have love for Weiss, and she does care. She's, it's tough love, you know? She's trying to give wife tough love. She's like, listen, if you're going to go against daddy, you got to make sure you're ready to support yourself, which is good advice for anybody out there. It's good advice. If you, before you start, you got to make sure you're ready to be independent at some point in your life, especially when you start making decisions that uh, don't quite go with the powers that be in your life. Oh, because at the end we see Weiss is, you know, she, she has decisions to make and that's going to determine her future, whether she wants to carry on her way or she's go back and run to daddy and do what daddy says. Uh, one little part, she was trying to learn... Uh, I believe they said it was called casting, casting, and she's like, I can't do it. But at the end, we saw her get just a little bit of it, just a little bit. So it's it's gonna be dope to see that development too. Uh, without further ado, uh, let's get into it. So of course, if you made this far and you haven't already, drop a sub on the channel, drop a like on the video. We turn out reactions on the channel three times a week, so make sure you turn on post notifications so you know exactly when we drop. If you want to catch me live, I'm live on Twitch every Monday and Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern. Check the top in the comment and description below for all my socials, including the Reddit, the Discord, and of course the Patreon, where you can find uncut, unreleased anime reactions. Ruby Reaction, Volume 3, Chapter 5, coming up next. Hey, just a quick thank you to all the subs on the channel. You members of the Nasty cast are the driving force that makes all this possible. Catch Director Nasty on Reddit, Patreon, and all other socials in the description below with links. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks again. Shit's tough. <clears throat> That's a lot of ships, bruh. Look who's this. Oh, that's a lot of white fang. Damn. Mm. Yeah, they definitely go they definitely either already smash or they gonna smash. There's no way Crow ain't tried to tap that already, bruh. Ugh. Please tell me that's Team Cardin, right? That looks like one of those Cardin punk bitches. Go ahead, do your thing, shawty. Yeah, Penny's a one girl wrecking crew. Crush them! Oh yeah, that's what they get. 
And victory goes to Penny and Sierra of Atlas. Thank you for a wonderful time. Good job, Penny. That other girl is just watching or just timing? Penny! Ruby! Jesus. Ruby, this is my teammate, Ciel Soleil. Hi, I'm Ciel Soleil. Team. Hails from Patch, leader of Team Ruby. Status, questionable. So, Penny. That's rude. Incredible. Don't assess. Don't use great sage on me, shawty. Handler. In a way, she's like Blake. But if Blake was ordered to spend time with you, oh, so wise. Precisely. Ha! How about, you know, beep boop up does not compute. Oh no, General Ironwood doesn't really want anyone to know. I'm mad she actually did that. But I was able to play it off. She got, she got a whole hat for a magnet, bro. I want to stay at Beacon. Ooh, that'd be dope. I know, but I have a plan. Oh no. Precisely one minute, ma'am. I'll talk to you more soon. You cute, but you pushy. Just my type. Rude. Remember to keep proper form. All right. Yeah, see, I, I still I believe in them, but I don't know why them. Are all versus one. I think we can expect stripped militant fighters with advanced technology and carefully rehearsed strikes. Or whatever they are. Your wife's me, right? The airy. I am. Hey. I do my best. Yeah, my dad was good too. Owned a little Dutch shop of his own. Till your father's company ran him out of business. Uh oh, Daddy dearest. Sure you are. Hey, why don't you? Hey, why don't you? That's what you sound like. Uh. <laughs> it's so childish but funny. This is just my normal hair. Ooh, really? Yeah. Is that a problem? You should try rollerblading sometime. It's super fun. It'd probably take you a while though. Yo, she went for the hair and the titties? Yo, Yang's about to fuck her up. That's gonna be funny. One. Begin. Really, a trumpet. Shawty's just out here grinding on it, bro. Not even in a good way either. I'm talking Tony Hawk style. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Wait, she got glow stick chucks? I'm dead, bro. Now you're heavy too. Yo, you keep talking about Yang, she gonna fuck you up. Damn, she's fast as hell. Mm-hmm. She's like enough for that. Ooh, my man hit that flip, son. That was so unnecessary, though. 
Oh, you fell for it, bro. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Oh, that's fire. That's dope. All right, all right. That was dope, Semblance. And I'm assuming hers is ice, because I keep seeing a white... Damn. She did what they had to do. Hey, it's one v one. Oh no. Oh, Flint Cole. Hulk reference? Oh, come on. A perfectly good Hulk reference. What the hell? Oh. Oh, damn. There you go, 1v1 then. Oh, 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 that's blouses. What a way to go out. Should have brought shoes, Shawty. Okay? I may not be seen for a while. You know, Damn. I'm not sure that was proper form. Oh, ha ha. <laughs> nah, great A tackle. I give it a solid B minus tackle, yo. Funky what? That was Funky. So I like it. Camaraderie! Fuck it! Oh, the you look like a hell of shit! You was going deep! What? You trying to hurt feelings. We're just going to be making a slight. No! What does that mean? It means that this will be even easier. Why is he doing push ups, not squats? He fights with his legs. More squats, boy! Finally, gangster talk. His heart is in the right place. He's just misguided. Sometimes I'm not even sure he has the heart. So, have you chosen your guardian yet? Raiden's two themselves. I simply believe I found the right candidate. Ever since the day I met her, I had a feeling she would be the one. She's strong. Most important, she's ready. Yeah, go get a shawty. I don't think about doing my shawty, Pira, but yeah, I'll get some. So I was never miss a beat. Ironically, that's exactly what led to their downfall. She missed the beat and ate it. 
Yang hit her with basically, or made her a reverse firework basically, and just shot her mid geyser stream in the air. Uh, the fight was dope. Uh, Flint Cole with the little, his semblance out fire. The killer quartet, yo, I like that. And then the, the glow stick chucks, like, what out of nowhere but it was fitting it was a fitting weapon for her that was dope uh i thought yang and weiss did admirably I i'm glad they won i think they put them up against people e beatable people for sure um their teamwork well they technically didn't have to work together i thought it kind of sucked that weiss didn't get to take out uh flint but the payoff of making yang go 2v1 was definitely worth it, hundred percent. Uh, Penny got the beat up. I'm I'm pretty sure that's two members of Team Cardin. Maybe not. Whoever, but Penny put the smackdown on them. Her little handler got a little attitude. I don't kind of like. I kind of don't like it, but I kind of do like it. But that's not the point. Looks like Pira's getting called up to the big leagues, yo. She looked ready, man. She looked ready, and she is ready according to Ospin, which I believe she seems to be the most well-rounded, complete person. I just wish you know. Just with Jean, give her a chance. That's it. But that's besides the point. Uh, moving forward, uh, the bat, the duo fights are still going. Uh, there's still an impending threat. It seems like we're trying to deal with uh, the politicalness of the fight of festival has been talked about. We haven't seen any implications of any fallout yet, quite yet. And it seems that Cinder has her hands on Penny's designs and knows, you know, what Penny is. So all that more to come. If you made this far and you haven't already, it's been three volumes, get it done. Drop a sub on the channel, drop a like on the video, comment down below, what's your favorite part of this volume so far? Did you, was that, oh, also tell me, was that Team Cardin that got their asses beat? Not sure, let me know. Uh, if you wanna catch me live, I'm live on Twitch every Monday, Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern. Check the top pinned comment and the description below for all my socials, including the Reddit, the Discord, and of course the Patreon where you can find uncut, unreleased anime reactions. I'm your man behind the camera, and as always, stay nasty, y'all. You nasty.